I'm going to spare you on my frustrating rant about how stupid this whole process was. And I'm just gonna show you how to do it, get right to the nitty gritty. How to reverse your ceiling fan if there's no switch on it and if there's no button that indicates reverse on here. Um, all right, <laughs> a little bit of searching online and this is what I found. So you gotta open it up, take all the screws, okay, it's open and here's a little finger pad that fits perfectly here. So there's one, two, three rows, but you'll see there's one, two, three, four. Oh my gosh, there's a secret little guy down there. What does that do? <gasps> Let's see. So I'm gonna take <laughs> this and just try to line it up and, and touch it um, just like it's being activated the correct way. Okay, so you should hear it click. That took a few too many times, but I don't know, I don't know why. But it kind of like, there's a subtle click, and then it should stop somewhat abruptly. Oh, come on, are you kidding me? Yes! There we go! <laughs> oh man, and I feel air just like that. I don't know how this happened. Apparently, um, if you push a bunch of buttons, it can reverse. So you just have to push a bunch of buttons to get it to go back. There's got to be an easier way. This is seriously so messed up. Anyways. I hope this helps.